Yeah, I thought in the tree. Hi. I'm sorry, I wasn't being weird. I was just looking past here because I used to live here a long time ago. You guys, we literally, we're literally about to go see Jalen and Jeremy's dad. <gasps> you guys? That my car is in the freaking. Do you guys remember this? What? Right here. Look to your right. We used to live here. Do you guys not remember that? We lived no. here. Jalen and Jeremy. It looked different. Oh no. shit. Oh. Right there. Where is this? This is where we used to live, you guys. Hi. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is the street we used to live on. And then what happened while we were here? We were in section eight. I finally, God blessed me with section eight. I lost it. I was, and I almost got in huge trouble and I almost had to pay all that money back for section eight because you were in my life. And they took it away from me. And then when I lost it, when we lost our section eight, <clears throat> Mommy, Mommy oh, that's where the people used to live. The, uh, they had like seven kids. Yeah. Well, no, that was an, that's the one that we that's the house we went to when we lost when we lost this one. We went you went to court because the guy took you to court, right? Yeah, you had forty eight hours to get out. We had forty eight hours to get out. How many? Huh? It was twenty four hours to get out. We had no money. Well, I, I don't even know. We had little to no money. <clears throat> Who? How many kids did we have? <clears throat> Just three. We had three kids. It was Kimadria, but over here it was Jalen, Jeremy, and Jordan. Juliana and JC wasn't born yet, and oh my God, it was the it was the worst, scariest moment of my life because we got we had 24 hours to leave. We didn't have good credit. We didn't have no money, and it's like you know, good places. You have to like put in applications and then wait. You guys know how that process goes. But we had 24 hours with three kids. What happened? With little. What do you mean what happened? Like why you had, to, had 24 hours to get out? Because we had to get out of this man's house. Y'all was paying the rent or something? Did we stop? We stopped paying the rent? Daddy? Did we? Daddy. Why did he no. put us out? He wouldn't fix. He wouldn't fix our bed. He wouldn't pay for our bed after the roof Daddy. collapsed and he got money from the storm. He want to fix the stuff that he, he messed up. And then you didn't pay the rent because of that reason? Yeah. So yeah, anyways, and then we and we were... We really couldn't afford it. Huh? We really couldn't afford it. Yeah, we couldn't afford it because we lost our Section 8 and all of that. It was like, how much it was? <coughs> huh? Section 8. 975 or some shit Yeah. $975 a month. And that was like, that was a pretty spacious place on the inside. And then we had to... You know, move here. Forty sixty Durant. We had to move. That God, you know, I didn't want to move here. It was very, very sad. But at the same time, we um. That was our house right there. This was a house right in the for not the first door, the second door. Hey, you right there. The mm hmm. And my friends. And they had like we came here and they had so many people on the Why street every night, different? huh? <clears throat> it doesn't look a little they still stay there. I wonder you think you guys remember we had friends that yeah, lived next door and they were really good it was this lady she had how many kids did she have she had seven. like Mommy, seven kids and yep and then we shot. seen on the news one of her sons got killed um around here because uh, they had him on camera though do you remember he, he, he pointed a gun at the police and the police <laughs> shot him no he was sitting yeah oh yeah he was in a garage somewhere he pointed a, a gun at the police he was he was sitting to talk to his mama and his mom went inside and then he was sitting and then the police drove past and he put his gun, no. and gun up to the police no the police, the that's police not it Jalen. that's what mommy told me he was in the building oh i'm gonna knock on that door so bad should you go? Okay, send one of the kids. No. Oh. I was gonna, <laughs> I was gonna 
can do it. Because they they'll be scared of like they won't be scared if a kid goes, you know. We don't even know if we're like, what's her name, Miss. L I forgot her name. Mom, her name Let's start with an L. I can't think about it. Yeah. So how long did we stay here for? Not this long. I don't even think we stayed here a year. We did stay here a year. We moved here in 2013. <laughs> and I remember, like, I remember this. I was so I was going to college. One of my friends, we drove down the street because my friends was um, visiting, and she was like. Oh, Renee lived in the hood. She lived deep, deep in the hood. I think I might go knock on the door. And oh my God, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. And then it just made me feel so. Oh my God, the gut feeling in my. What is wrong, Daddy? How do you don't know what's gonna happen? Oh my God. Yo, what? Those people got a gun. They gonna shoot you and they go pop. Yo. I take that bet. He literally just went to go knock on the door to see if this lady. She was really. Oh my God. Nope. Oh my god. Yes. Huh? She didn't live there. They moved. Uh, this is this is officially. Never mind. What? Never if mind. you if you stay in one house, yeah, I thought she lived like right here or something. Who answered the door? Like, what do they look like? Could be uh, Latino. That's all that's around here now is Latino. Oh, I would have literally sure. loved to see that lady. Mm -hmm. I can't think of her name. So yeah guys, I didn't even know that I was about to give you guys a story time, but I just gave y'all a story time. I think her daughter, I think when I was in kindergarten, <clears throat> I was either in 4th grade or 6th grade, but I can't remember. Yeah. They used to watch you, but... Yeah, well, we used what to do you mean at, they used to watch me? They used to watch them when they get off the bus and stuff. My so French, I used to get on the bus. Oh yeah! The bus oh my the god, they were so nice to us. Mommy, you remember What's what her we name? What is your her name? Like, if you're watching this video, like, on well, one of your kids or something, like, just comment down below. I doubt that she'd be even watching me because it's Mommy, like, boy, like. I remember when y'all went on the cruise, and uh, I was, I was with all the, all the. You got your seatbelt on. Which street are you should used to live on? This street. What did you? Devo, we buy Krispy Kreme. We get to get Krispy Kreme and bring home. Yeah. Right? Are you happy? <laughs> Alright you guys, so that's that for that video. A little story time that I wanted to tell you guys because we just happened to We're just riding. We're just taking a ride. Um and some getting some fresh air. Why did you come here? Nobody told you to come here. Oh my god, I'll never forget this. Actually, Mommy, when I walked the streets, I actually lived in two houses here. You know that, right? Why you lived in two houses? We lived in one house first for a while. You were when you were born, <laughs> and then. Jalen remember everything about her childhood. Uh, Jalen is actually the only baby I had. Jalen been through some stuff with me. She doesn't even remember it. <laughs> Do you remember? You don't remember before that? I don't remember. But it was so happy. Jalen? Where the house at? Not here. I, I mean, what? Metal. I did not live on Meadow Street. You did. You did. Did he? There was times where I walked down here while I was pregnant, while I was a, with the Jalen, when I was going so through bad situations. No, bro, not in no, this street. Not the house. No. No. Oh, oh my God, that's the house. Back up. Oh my god, those people are looking at me. That is the house. This is where I lived at the second time. This is where your daddy picked me up from. Toronto? Yes. This is where your daddy picked me up when that thing happened to John. Then I brought it to the suburbs and it's after that. Boy, shit. shut it. And I fell in the tree. Hi. I'm sorry, I wasn't being weird. I was just looking past here because I used to live here a long time ago. So I didn't want to like make y'all think I was spying on you or something. <laughs> okay, have a good day. Bye. This was the second place, which was much better than the first place Daddy, that I lived. Daddy, what a big Jeremy house. Bro, did he? Bro, I see the doll the feeling. Wait. Wait. What other house was that? Myrtle? This way. Jeremy, your dog. Right? This is Meadow, not Myrtle. Jeremy, your dog. Your dog right? Meadow Street. Oh my God, the feeling. Why? Daddy, go to big Jeremy house. What street? Laura? No. Oh, not. oh, I know what you're talking about. Oh, what? I know that street in the apartment. 
Oh my god, bro. I walk down these streets a very a lot of times. Is this it? And, no. Yeah, no. I walked down these streets so many times. I was pregnant. I had Jalen. One time a cop picked me up. I was walking to Asia's house. I ran away from you know who. And a cop picked me up one day in the dark because he thought something was wrong with me. And then he dropped me off at Asia's house. Oh my god, I hope nobody I see. This is where I lived the first time for a while. Oh, the window. Um, oh my god. This is where I lived at right there. Daddy, could you pull Jeremy's window up, please? <sighs> for real? Daddy, could you go to my dad? I don't know where he lived. You gotta call him. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, you know Big German now? Back up, back up. Oh, shit. Daddy, like, Daddy, go that way, Daddy. To the I think he lives down there. Man, they Should I call him? Somewhere. I'll call. You got his new number? I don't know. Jalen, do you? Yeah. He got phone. Oh my I god. Did he? Oh, okay, so. Jeremy, how did he get on this road? No. He called me before, is, right? Uh, did he ever text me? Uh -uh. You have to look for he like called not too long ago, huh? Someone's he called but me. But like, how will I find Jeremy his number? He called me on my, my, my birthday. So. Huh? It was at Flipsons Cruise. So that you guys, the place I just showed you guys was where I lived at when when Jaylen and Jeremy was conceived. And it was a hard knock life for me. It's a hard knock life for me. Are you guys excited? Hello. You guys, we literally, we're literally about to go see Jalen and Jeremy's dad. For now. Yeah, no, I know this nigga. Oh my god. Is that it? You go. No, you go first. Open the door. Who's that? Hello. What's up, dog? What's happening? Chilling. Hey, let me hit you back. What's up, Jordan? Take your seatbelt off, Jordan. Go say hey. Why I can't? Why I can't say fat? <laughs> why I can't call you fat? <laughs> They were very excited to come see you, actually. Why did you cut your hair off? <laughs> That's how it works. I'm working so much in the plant. I know I have time to do now. I work seven days a week. Mm -hmm. So I cut are you still working through this thing? Are you still working through this pandemic? Yeah. What plant you work at? Huh? What plant you work at? Yeah, I work at all. Mm-hmm. Turn around. I work all over the <laughs> what kind of work you was doing? Operate crane. Yep. They look just like him. <laughs> Can I record you? How did it feel? Jerm? Mm -hmm. huh? How did it feel, Jerm? Good. Good. Mommy, do yeah. I really look just like him? <laughs> Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I look like him. Don't you? you don't look exactly like him, but you have his features like 